Our next guests make up a band that some critics have called the best in Vancouver. Buck Cherry, Mary Jo Kopechny, Randy Valentino, and Ian Noble are the modernettes, and they're here to play a song off their latest extended play album, View from the Bottom. Ladies and gentlemen, the disarming sounds of the modernettes with the rebel kind. They call us the rebel kind, but they I should think so. Keep uh, that applause going. Very nice, too, the modernettes. Oh, my, welcome. There you go. And Buck, would you ever see you? Uh, oh, sure, yeah. Sure. I'll talk to you. Oh, me. my. That's fun stuff. It's not so much fun when you're that scared, but... Uh, <laughs> oh, you weren't scared, eh? were you? Uh, no, I was scared this morning. But this, this morning? You have uh, a really nice green room. It's not even green, is it? Yeah, that's no. the best thing about yeah, it. Yeah, what a place that is. Huh? Stan yeah. Can in there and the mayor in there. And yeah, Gord Reset. Gord Reset. We were real nice to him. You didn't call him a sissy, did you? No, no. I called him no. Gordy. <laughs> oh, did you? On a first name basis with Mr. Reset. She oh, hustles my. fighters. <laughs> oh, does she really? The Modernettes. Uh, in the Leisure magazine not too long ago, you were called the top band in all of Canada. That's yeah, right. we're still paying him for that. Oh, yeah, yeah. It cost you a bundle, did it? Yeah. Uh, why, then, are you not uh, selling out Maple Leaf Gardens or something and, and are quite happy to stay in and around Vancouver, smiling Buddha, that I kind of thing? I wouldn't say happy. Oh, you aren't happy? Well, no, I mean, that's, it's fine, but, well, we don't really do anything that's one particular thing. That sounds like money anyway. To make money, you need money. Yeah. To, to, well, to make, yeah. So Is there something wrong with making money, though? Not no. at all. No, no, okay. <laughs> I don't think it'd be that much fun to play Maple Leaf Gardens, really. Why? Well, that'd be... I don't know. I don't like going to shows, places like that. Too big. Yeah. yeah. Well, you know, it's it's not a particularly exciting atmosphere. Mm -hmm. You have a uh, a cover here I wanted to show, because this I had this cover uh, of this. Where do you want me to hold this up? It it is that or is that not William Holden? That's Bill is that Holden. is that Bill Holden in in, in Sunset Boulevard? That's Bill Holden in Sunset yeah. Boulevard. He's floating in, in a pool, face down. He's yeah. dead. Have yeah. you seen the film? Wow. No, but I saw the cover and I thought. If that is anybody, that's William Holden on there. Yeah, Why really William funny. Holden? His nose, too. It looks like that David Bowie album. It's all... Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> Why did you do that, uh, Buck? Uh, well, I really like the movie. 
I'm, and so I'm really a big fan of films, so yeah. You know, I just thought that uh, we had the title view from the bottom, and I thought that uh, since that was a view from the bottom, that mm -hmm. would be apropos. Why the name, other than the fact that maybe your mother gave it to you? Why the name Buck Cherry? Uh, well, it was my mother's idea, strangely enough. Was it really? And I wonder. Not if at I, birth, though. I imagine. Uh, well, no. No. no, no, no. <laughs> I want. I, I know this is really corny, but I, I, where's the camera? Whichever Where, one you. That one would be good. Uh, yeah. So I want to say hi to my mom and dad. They're watching out in Mission, and this is probably even more exciting for them than it is for me. Great. Well, you probably made their night. Yeah, I hope so. I yeah. owe them a lot of money. <laughs> <laughs> the, uh, the, the music industry is an expensive one, is it not? Uh, uh, yeah, it's, it's yeah. pretty hard to start up a band, and, yeah. and it's, it has a really high overhead just keeping one going. Like, especially the, the better you want to play, you sort of need stuff that works mm -hmm. as opposed to breaking down all the time. Mm -hmm. So you go into debt for that. Yeah. You're making money, though. You're rolling in it now, aren't you? No. Uh, no, you're not. Oh. She had to pay to get this dry clean. Yeah, that's nice, though. It's a nice job. Uh, now, Mary Jo, uh, I have to ask about your name because, uh, you know, some, uh, some could find uh, the Mary Jo Kopechny name. Distressing. Distressing is one word that leaps to mind. Um, why Mary Jo Kopechny, the girl that died at Chappaquiddick? Well, actually, my swimming instructor gave me that name. Ooh, oh, let's take a vote on that. Proud, what do you think? <laughs> That's a pretty rugged statement, I think. Uh, gosh, I, I'll leave it at that. Um, well, it's better than Karen Carpenter. <laughs> Ooh. Well, don't you think it's pretty funny? Anybody rich who dies of starvation? That's kind of, it's a little <laughs> weird. It's more than weird there. Uh, well, I think we should move on to lighter I think, topics. Yeah, <laughs> I think so. Uh, as, as one person once said, uh, death is not a laughing matter. Especially if you're the one dying, you know that. Yeah. Probably be you, uh, you folks uh, are going to do what now? I understand Ian is dying to be uh, rich and famous. Is he? The uh, drummer? Yeah. Is yeah. Ian dying to be rich and famous? Uh, Ian's just released his first book. It's just been published. <laughs> it's called Bold Horizons in Advertising. Bold Horizons in Advertising. Is this an in-joke? Oh, no. No, no. no. Ian, Ian's, Ian's the token... Uh, token success in the band. He's 19 years old, he owns two cars, and he dresses nicely, and he's got a really beautiful girlfriend. Wow. Which, uh, Jeez, what happened to the rest of you folks? Did they... I don't know, we took a wrong turn. <laughs> yeah, all right. Well, anyway, you got another tune for us. Yeah, this is called I Can Only Give You Everything. I Can Only Give You Everything, uh, including a new swimming coach. Uh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm telling you. Would you guys like to uh, toddle over there, and yep. I'll... Uh, this one's for Long get... McQuaid. For who? Long and McQuaid. Long and McQuaid. Another uh, cheap uh, commercial announcement there from the, uh, the Modernettes. As they're getting ready, ladies and gentlemen, a warm welcome for the Modernettes with a thoroughly modern pop song. I can only give you everything. <laughs> <laughs> 